Hello everybody! Welcome to the very first episode of Experience Share! Go ahead and create a file. I'm sitting here with my lovely girlfriend. State your name and business. My name is Kaylee, and I'm gonna play this silly ass dragon game. <laughs> You're gonna play Spyro. It's not a silly ass dragon game. Go ahead and select new game in empty space. We're starting a new adventure. Yay! <laughs> I just want everybody to know that she volunteered. I did not. I didn't make her do this. Okay, rolling. Oh, it's been peaceful here in the five worlds, or is it six? For a dragon's age. We now have 12,000 treasure, or is it 14,000? What about this Ganasty Gnort character? Now I understand he's found a magic spell to turn gems into warriors for his cause. I'll take that question. Nasty Nork is a simple Vampire. creature. Vampire. He has been contained in a remote world and is no threat to the Dragon Kingdom. No threat! Besides, he is ugly. Ugly? <laughs> that does it! Looks like I've got some things to do. And that's the plot of the game, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> he has some things to do, so he's going to go and save the entire dragon race. It's a very simple game. I hope so. I hope it's easier than the second one was. Oh, sh we don't want to let them know that you've already played the second one. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's, that's great. Oh no, the game's broken. Better not be broken. I spent a long time preparing all this shit. <laughs> uh, I'm pretty sure it's broken, so I'll do anything. Oh, there we go. Oh, hey, there's Spyro. Hey, dear little boy, how you doing? Welcome to Spyro. Okay, so this one is barely different from the second one. All the controls are exactly the same. Cool. Oh, oh no, that's, that's, that's a good thing. Oh, Thank you for releasing me, Spyro. Free ten dragons in the artisan world. Then find the balloonist. He'll transport you to the next world. What about Nasty Nork? I'm going after him. Find dragons first. That's all I can tell you. But I want to do the fun stuff. <laughs> this game is fun stuff. So I'm going to tell you a little bit about the plot of the game. Every time that you release a dragon, uh, you get... Uh, Actually, every time you release a dragon. Silly off over here. Well, I missed the front one. Yep, there it is. Well, it's okay because what's his face there? Will uh, sparks will get you gems that you want close to. That's a life. They're spiral heads. Weird ass super spiral heads. But basically, everything else is the same. Every time you go into a portal, you'll get transferred into a new world. All your viewers are gonna watch this and be like, has this bitch ever played a fucking game before? <laughs> <clears throat> and the answer is yeah, you've played Crash 3 and Spyro 2. Yeah, but that was like a year ago. Because someone likes to tell me my, how to do my business. Who's that someone? You! <laughs> uh, yeah, you better run. Oh, he's running. And I'll hide in the corner with a little <laughs> 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 The enemies make a lot better sounds in this game. And they don't shoot me, and they don't shock me with cannon They... <laughs> really? There are gems, and then there's the balloonist. Ooh. But you won't have to worry about the balloonist guy yet, because you don't have... You have one dragon. Oh, that's true. So the mission of this game is to free the entire dragon race. Very simple. So every time you see one of those giant green statues in the shape of a dragon, go get it. Because that's the mission. Put that one right over there. To your right. That guy. Don't make that sound too. Where's Nasty Nork? I'll torch him. Keep your horns on, Spyro! You have much to learn first. Do you know what the dragonfly following you is doing? Um... His name is Sparks, and he's helping and protecting you. Keep an eye on him and see what I mean. Basically, in the hub world, they'll all tell you that... Simple. 
Apple stuff that I can easily just tell you right now. Because you already know. Because I'm a master in video games. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> You're the best. I'm the best of the best of the best. It's oh yeah, he's not- hey, he's not dead yet. What do you mean not dead yet? He drops five of those red things. Wait, I missed it. No, come on, come on. Come on, come on. I can't tell I yet, think that's but... it. I think that's five. Yeah, there you he's go. Gone. Yep, he's all gone now. Good job. You won. Yeet! Do you see any more dragons? What the, well, you're only in part one of the hub world. I have to go the long way down. No, turn around. What? You just climbed up a hill. No, turn around, turn left. Turn left. Left. <laughs> left. <laughs> Lefter. <laughs> Climb that hill. You're a dragon, you have wings. Turn around. Are those sheeps? Those are sheeps. Fly to that. No, what are you doing? I'm getting the sheep. Stick to the mission objectives. <laughs> See, he doesn't even eat them. Turn around. That was on the to the right. <laughs> it's backwards. To the right. See that right there? Jump and glide to it. Oh, nailed it. You did it. You done good. Good job. I think the music is skipping quite bad. Yeah, I can't even hear. <laughs> I need to go through and get copies of the games again. Get those smug bastards. They're running. I can Chase see them. that. Faster. Shut up. Oh. He's right for me. You gonna run it away? Probably. It is a dragon. Tomas. Hey Spyro, press the jump button twice to glide. And, and don't be afraid. Afraid? Of what? Falling from high mountain peaks? Plummeting into prehistoric glaciers? Oh, that. <laughs> Simple stuff for a dragon. What do you mean prehistoric? Are they trying to tell you that dragons have been around with dinosaurs? Or that dinosaurs were actually dragons? Oops, Nothing wrong with that. Butts were meant for falling. That's a nice little thing. That's true. Nailed it! Skippy. Yeah, I know. Once you start going into it? worlds, though, this should change. No, no bitch! Get up there. Yeah, can I go back up this way? Well, yes, you can. Shall I go back up this way? You can do whatever you want. You have the controller, not me. I am the co-commentator. <coughs> Square to charge and go places faster. Oh. I was like, why are you taking so long? So if you ever want to save, just stand and stay on one of those platforms there, and then that fairy lady will talk to you. Save game. Oh, it doesn't auto save like the other one? No, it does not. This is back in the day. Everything's manual. You have to press buttons. Let's see, you want to tackle a world? I want to free wanna... the dragons. Well... Oh, is there ten dragons throughout the whole game? <laughs> no. What? There are so many dragons across the oh, entirety no. of this game. Like, you haven't even been over there yet. Okay. To your left now. Don't worry about torching every sheep that you find. Because, I mean, he won't eat them in this game. He won't eat them. Sparks won't eat them when he's gold in the first one. Uh, hey! Hi there. Hey. Argus. 
Our goose. Cool flash! Do that again! The artisan's boss is through a portal in the dragon mouth, but you are not yet ready, Spyro. First you must complete one of the other artisan lands. Oh, that's the boss level. Can't go in there yet. What are you doing? I'm saving my game. Why? Why not? You haven't even done anything. <laughs> I just freed a dragon, black hole. <laughs> And I'm sure you'll free next time. Free, free more dragons next time on Experience Share. XP Share. We don't want copyright infringement. When I say next time on XP Share, you're supposed to stop playing. Oh. <laughs>